Welcome everybody into this new tutorial. So let's take a look how we can buy or sell tokens here into the coin market cap. This full tutorial, I'm going to show you what is coin market cap. I'm going to show you um, how is this working. If it's really possible to buy or sell tokens here into coin market cap, and I'm going to show you what we can do inside coin market cap and what we can do with this website and use it as a tool for your exchange and cryptocurrencies. So let's start talking about what is Coin Market Cap. So Coin Market Cap is a website that provides the cryptocurrency market cap rankings, charts, and more. So this website tracks capitalization of various cryptocurrencies by listing prices that are available to apply, the trade volume over the last 24 hours, or market capitalizations here. So there are a bunch of tokens listed in here, such as the price. Let's say it's like a Bible of the cryptocurrencies. So speaking about the concept of the cryptocurrencies into coin market cap, those can only be purchased on an exchange, whether that would be a decentralized or centralized in nature. So since no exchange is superior to the other one, a fair price of a cryptocurrency is the average price. It is traded on a range of exchanges. So the service is calculating by the average price. So that means that since coin market cap is not an exchange for cryptocurrencies, you cannot buy or you cannot sell tokens inside this website and or application. So that might be a misunderstanding speaking about buying or selling cryptocurrencies into coin market cap because speaking about like let's say this is like a bible for cryptocurrencies you're going to find all the information about the cryptos but you cannot make trades inside the coin market cap application. But that doesn't mean that it can be helpful for helping us to buy or sell cryptocurrencies. So that's the reason why I want to show you what we can actually do here into coin market cap. So the first thing I want to take a look here I want to show you is the cryptocurrency section where you have where you have everything about the cryptocurrencies you can see it by ranking by recently added categories spotlight the bunch of things that you can uh, filter if you want to take a look into tokens but i'm going to go into ranking so what i want to do here is is to look at the trending um cryptocurrencies right now at the moment so i want to go into more as you can see this one says flow so this one at the moment it's like the most um popular here at the moment so what I want to do is to go into the view and community just in case that I want to figure it out why is that. Here you have the flow, here you have the price, the graphic, then how it's been going here for the latest day, for the latest 24 hours. So I want to go into 7 days to take a look at this uh, token as you can see this one. So let's say that I want to go into the latest 3 months. So as you can see this has been not going so well in this month but now it's going it's gaining a lot of volume here so if I choose on the last year I'm gonna see that this token the value of this token was like uh, $25 and now it has going really really down into a little bit more than a dollar the flow social estimate so if you want to buy this token you can totally do that into your uh, exchange so I can go into my Binance account I can go into my wallet my fiat and spot and see if this token is available to buy into this exchange. So I'm going to go once again into the search coin. I want to select F flow. And here it is. It's actually available to buy it. So I can select the option that says buy. And I can buy my token really quick. Now, if you're willing to buy new tokens that are recently added, we can take a look here into coin market cap the recently added. So I'm going to go to cryptocurrencies. I'm going to go into recently added. And as you can see here, you have like the first one says uh, FIFA World Cup fans, but they on the latest hour and in the latest 24 hours is not going so well. So I don't want to take a look at this um, at the moment. I want to take a look and see, for example, this Chihuahua token. And I want to click in here. So I'm going to take a look at how it's been going so far. So the price is started right now. I'm going to go into seven days. If I know that I can gain. Um, some dollars in here and I want to convert here some tokens let's say for example that I want to buy this token right so the amazing thing here into coin market cap is that we can use this information to buy it so as you can see this option says contract so what you guys want to do is to copy this address and you want to look for a website called pancakeswap.finance slash swap and here what you can do is to trade almost every token so let's say for example that I have just a few 
Um, I'm gonna go into my wallet and what I want to do is to copy the contract in here. You just need to make sure this is a smart chain. And what I want to do is to go in here and I want to paste the address. So now what I want to do is to say I understand and I want to import this token. So if I want to buy this token, I just need to select the balance in here. I just need to go into swap. So in order to see that transaction, you can go into your Binance Smart Chain here into the MetaMask. I want to import my token. I'm going to paste the same token as we just had. And I want to add my custom token so I can import it. But in here, so once the transaction has been done successfully, I'm going to see here my transaction has been already been done. So so once I added here my token into MetaMask, it's going to be popping up a new notification window. Uh, token, I want to close this real quick. And as you can see, here's my balance. So I want to go back into my MetaMask. And what I want to do is to go into my assets. And as you can see, here's my tokens that are now available into my MetaMask. For example, let's say that I want to make a transfer from uh, Binance into MetaMask. So what I want to do is to go into my wallet. I want to go into my fiat and spot. And once I am in here, what's going to happen is, let's say that I want to look for a, a hot token. For example, I want to go into CoinMarketCap. I want to go into some ranking tokens. And I want to look for a token that works into, for example, maybe uh, Avalanche in here. So what I want to do is to copy this address. As you can see, it says contract address. I want to copy this address or you can add that to MetaMask. But for example, I'm going to go into MetaMask. I want to choose a smart chain. And now in here, I want to go into input tokens and I want to paste the contract address, which is AVEX. So once I fill that, once I import my token, I can copy this address. I want to go back into my Binance and look for the AVEX token. I want to choose withdraw and it's going to be asking us for an address. So that's the reason why we copy the address from MetaMask using the smart chain. So I want to paste the address in here and the network shall be smart chain. Yes, I'm pretty sure. So you enter the amount that you want to send and you go into withdraw. And you might see the recent which is going to be appearing in here. So while we use coin market cap into this specific situation, because after we make the transaction, you might not see reflected your money, your assets inside your wallet because you don't see the uh, IVEX token inside your assets. So that's the reason why we went into input tokens. We figured out how to paste the, the contract address from coin market cap and as you can see it's been already added so it won't let me to do that again just get into continue and you might see that your assets are now available and lastly guys what i want to show you here into coin market cap you might not gain real money inside coin market cap or tokens but what you can do is to earn something called diamonds in here from coin market cap and in order to gain that first you need to have your account you can create one just by signing up with your Binance account. So what I want to do is to go into sign in and fill my information right in here or use a Binance account if I go into the login section. But you don't have to worry about that because I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description, guys. So you can sign up totally for free and you might get a few rewards just by signing up. So now that you have your account already opened, you want to go into this little icon of diamonds is coin market cap diamonds and basically you can earn some rewards just by signing in as you can see we can collect our daily diamonds just by checking in here and if you locked in for seven days in a row you might earn up to 50 diamonds uh just in one day so there's a very easy way that we can't earn some diamonds and if we are talking about earning avatars, mystery box, NFTs and all that, just by using your diamonds, your daily diamonds that are totally for free, well, you are gaining a lot of things totally for free here into CoinMarketCap. And of course, you have the refer program here. So if you enter in here into CoinMarketCap, you and the other person are going to gain 100 diamonds just by signing in. So there's another way that you can earn money. So now we know how to the coin market cap works. We know how to use cryptocurrencies. We know how to use these tools. We know how to learn here into coin market cap, creating some portfolios in watch list. Also the watch list and the portfolio section. If you go into the watch list, for example, in here, 
uh, you can look for a specific tokens that you want to see for example as you can see there are a bunch of tokens that I have here uh, let's say for example that I'm not interested into this um, watch list section so let's say I go into more I want to edit let's say I want to look a for a brand new watch list I want to make this public I want to create my watch list and I'm going to go into add coins. So let's say, for example, that I want to look for the token that you just add into uh, our MetaMask, which is the Chihuahua token. I want to select this one. I'm going to select one coin so I can track this coin uh, right now, right? So it's really, really easy just to track this specific token. And speaking about the portfolio section, if you go into the portfolio, you can create your own portfolio. For example, I want to go into create portfolio. I want to create once again brand new i'm going to go into create portfolio and now what you can do is to add some tokens that you already have here so i'm going to go into brand new i'm going to go into add new i'm going to look for the token that we just purchased which is chihuahua token and it's going to be asking you how much you have so what i want to do is to look for my token which is right in here and I want to paste it. This is the quantity here, the price. It was the same that we just purchased and I want to add the transaction. And as you can see, I have $2 of this um, token here. So let's say for example, that I want to sell that once my holding says $10 or maybe $20. So it's really easy to have here um, your money on one portfolio. Let's say for example, that you have cryptocurrencies in Phantom Wallet, in MetaMask Wallet, in Binance, in Coinbase, and you want to gather everything just in one portfolio. Well, here into Coin Market Cap, you can do that just by having here uh, everything in your portfolio, and you can create more than just one portfolio. As you can see, I have another transactions. So there are a bunch of things that we can do into Coin Market Cap. Once again, guys, hopefully this was a very useful information for you. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more about this Coin Market Cap application. It's been a major pleasure, and I'll see you next time.